Alright, through the door. Hey, check it out. Two green herbs in the corner. Um, do I really want to pick these up? Yes, I do, because I've got the space to. Um, you have to be careful in a second, because this might actually become a three green herb mix, because I've kind of screwed it up. Oh, well, never mind. I'll just make it a two green for now. Um, along this corridor, you will see lots more broken windows. If you head down here, if you picked up the cord from the room of the liquor in, there is a panel there. You can use the cord, and it will shut the windows, which is a relatively good idea considering zombies fall through that later on. Check these shelves, you'll find shotgun shells. Never say no to shotgun shells. If you're given a choice between handgun bullets and shotgun shells, take the shells. Unless your handgun's empty, in which case you can take both. Because you can put the handgun bullet straight in your sh uh, gun. Down here, dogs. Uh, two or three, I think. You don't even have to kill these things, I don't. Depends on my mood, but he's coming around the corner, I'm going to put a bullet in his head. Which will actually trigger the other two to come as well. There, uh, still the same one. He's not dying. There you go, that one's dead. Right, now, just to be safe, move a little bit out of the way so you can see the corridor. Bring your gun up. And basically wait, I think... I think that dog's stuck on a pixel. Now, this is going to be a bit of a risk. But you want to run out of this corridor and turn right. So, head for it. Sprint, because there's a dog there and there's a dog in front of you. Go for the brown doors. Into the power room. This isn't, this isn't essential, but this is a very good idea. Because um, there's nothing in it. There's like a herb in the corner. Oh, hey, herb. Uh, do I even bother picking you up? Not really. I'll find out in a second. Run over here. Is there anything on the desk? I can't remember. No, there isn't. Okay. Run around the back of this block. Don't worry about anything being in here. There's nothing. There's a map, which is always useful to take. And head over to the corner, which is why you came in here. There is a power transformer. Reserve power control panel. Um, basically, this can be trial and error, but you only get one shot at it. Now, each one of these is 36, and you've got to make it add up to 80. If you want the answer, up, up, down, up, down. So you go up, up, down, up, all the way up to the other side. And down again. Levels 80. So if you flick them up, they add to 36. If you flick them down, it goes down 14. So power supply, okay. And that then activates the lock on the arm storage, which is a freaking good idea to do because when you go into arm storage, you can't do it yet. So don't worry. I'm not going to pick up. I'm leaving that herb behind because I'm a dumbass, actually. Yes, I'm leaving that herb behind. Um, Okay, going out of this door, you want to carry heading on right, so run towards the screen. Be careful of the dogs if you haven't killed them. Um, that opens arms locker. You can't go in the arms locker until you come back. And when you do, which is why I just ran past. And there's a dog there. Where did he come from? Oh, well, never mind. Ah! Damn it! Head into parking. You don't need to go the other way. Claire goes the other way. Leon goes into parking. Um, there won't be anything out here. But... Run forwards. You can't go into armed storage just yet. And now you meet the most annoying character in existence, because she can't even shoot straight, because she sucks. Hello, Miss Ada. <coughs> Bitch in a red dress! All the time in a red dress. Fucking woman. Sorry, I don't get along with Ada. I never have got along with her. She's the most annoying character in existence. Oh my god. Watch the cutscene. She apologises, thought you were a zombie. Doesn't tell Leon anything, she's a bitch. She's a spy who uses her real name. Really fucking clever. Thank you, Shadow Leggy, for that video. That was fantastic. If only she made the stupid face like she does in Shadow Leggy's videos. That'd be fantastic. Oh, there's a herb in the corner. I never realised that was there before. I'm going to run over and see what it is. I'm Actually, I've got... A, I'm not going to bother. I've got a green herb in my inventory I can use. As you noticed, I'm on caution, because I suck. I got bitten by a dog that wasn't even on the screen, which is kind of cheating, so... Never mind. Yeah. Work together to move the... Work together to move the police truck. I don't know how two people could ever move that thing. It's fucking a SWAT... Uh, SWAT... Um... Transportation van. But... Leon, being a tank, even if he hasn't got melon arms like Chris Redfield and Resi 5, manages to push it with Ada. So I push it out of the way, door, blah, 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 blah. I'm walking you through this game instead of taking a piss out of it like I was going to. Never mind. Um, keep moving it. Basically, it's a cutscene. You don't even have to press forward to move it. Um, 
If you really want, over here in the corner, Ada will follow you. As you can see from the slightly orange pot, there is a green herb. I'm actually going to pick this up and I'm going to use it straight away because I've only got... Why have I got ten handgun bullets? Oh, Jesus. Um, I'm failing for ammo, by the way, so... Don't follow my guide to the letter because... Well, don't follow... This isn't even a guide, it's a video. It's a piss take video. It's meant to be, but I got bored. Blah. Um, rambling off topic. Um, don't follow this exactly because I'm running out of bullets. Ada never listens to Leon. Um, I'm running out of bullets. Basically, follow the corridor, follow the corridor, follow the corridor. Don't go through that door back there just yet. Run straight to the end. Grab the handgun bullets off the table, because I need them. I am in dire need of them. Uh, fill your gun up. Go through, straight through here. You'll meet a guy called Ben, who's quite a character. Even if he's in the game for the better part of about eight lines. Run into this prison cell, and if you check, look, herbs. I think it's a green and a blue. Yep, yeah, there's your first blue herb. Don't even bother picking up blue herbs. I never do. I never get poisoned. The only time I'm ever going to get poisoned, I'll be pretty much right next to somewhere somewhere I can find a blue herb. So, there's Ben. Let's look at Ben. Let me guess. You must be Ben. Ben, right? Get up. Get up. Now. Bang, bang. Leon being the cop tries to play the good guy. Just guesses his job. I'm trying to sleep here. It's probably the worst zombie survival tactic I've ever seen, locking yourself in a police cell. But never mind. Mm. Ada comes in, blah blah blah. City officials that you knew something about what's been going I love how... Oh, my telephone's ringing. I'm gonna stop. Oh, wait, hang on. Okay. Hang on a second, guys. Video. Thank you. Hello? 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 No, he's not in at the moment. Thank you. Sorry about that. People seem to like ringing me when I make videos. That's like the third time it's happened today. Yes, Ben's being a bastard. Well, blah blah blah. Uh, this bit sucks. Hurry up. Yeah, that's your first impression of William Birking. Screams! Um, hurry up. This, I, can't, I hate not being able to skip these cutscenes. Yeah, we'll lead it right to you to be a bastard. I'm the only cop. He's not even wearing a cop uniform anymore. I love how that, and Leon's like, you have to leave with me if you want to live. He doesn't even know where he's fucking going, for God's sake. Stupid. He has to get pointed uh, the, pointed in the right direction by a reporter who refuses to unlock his own cell. And Ada runs off. Again! You'll get used to Ada running off, because it's all Ada can ever do is run off. Before you leave this area, grab the twinkle. You can't do the next little bit without picking up that manhole opener, so make sure you grab it. Uh, don't worry too much about space in your in Ben because you're about to get to a save room so if you've only got one slot don't worry you've only got one slot it's fine uh, I probably could have picked up that other green herb now in hindsight but never mind um, back out into this corridor follow the corridor and go through the door that you ignored last time this is the kennels um, you gotta be careful in here because sometimes there's dogs in the actual kennels themselves and if you go too far up you trigger an attack and I'm really not in the mood for triggering a dog attack They'll bark, you can hear them barking, but they won't actually attack you unless you go up there. In which case, I think there's a couple of herbs in one of the cells, but in all fairness, it's not a worthwhile exchange. You ditch the man opener, manhole opener. Right, because I'm cautious, I don't have my shotgun. Fantastic, go down the manhole. Get ready to run like a bastard because there's two, two spiders in this corridor. Now, I didn't bring my shotgun to deal with them, but normally I don't bother. There you go, you can see one of them there. Turn your handgun onto auto just in case you have to fire at them and run as soon as you see that thing climb up onto the roof. Because when he's on the roof, he's not as much of a threat. There's one on the floor around there though, it's going to get in my way. Nope. See, the good thing about spiders is they're relatively easy to dodge. Kind of. Uh, the one thing you need to be careful of is when they spit poison. They'll actually rear up on their hind legs and they'll spit poison down at you. Now that can poison you and it sucks. 
but in all fairness, you should never have to fire a single bullet at a spider. But in case you do, do this, grab a blue herb and always keep a blue herb in your chest. You don't have to carry it with you unless you're going to be a picky bugger and take a double green blue, um, which I don't really do most of the time. Drop off your herbs because you're not going to need them. I'm going to ditch my shotgun shells because I'm not carrying my shotgun. Uh, this bit is relatively interesting. I'm going to... Do I know what I'm going to do? I'm actually going to be uh, take a shortcut. To save space and time, there's a, uh, a boss fight coming up in the next area, but not yet. Grab your three plugs, uh, Rook, Bishop, and King, and go out here. Out onto this corridor. Basically, this is the way you get out of the police station. I ran over ten minutes again, so I'm going to stop here. I will follow on in a second.